Hi guys, my name's Sam. Um, this is a beginner and intermediate English class about prepositions of time in, at, on, from, and to. So come join us if you want. Um, we'll be looking at the grammar and we will also be doing lots of exercises today. So come hang out with us. I'll just wait for you guys to join. In the meantime, I'll put this up on the screen. So you can see what we're going to be doing today. Hello. Hi, Sarah. Come on in. Hi, Olga. Hi, teacher. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you, teacher? I'm good, thanks. Um, so we're looking at prepositions today. Woo. <laughs> uh, oops. To warm up, I want you to tell me a little bit about your family. So how many brothers and sisters do you have? So, Olga? Yeah, that, yes, teacher. Uh, um, um, I I have no I have no brother and, and no sister. Oh, okay. So you're an I'm only child. Yes, I am alone. Mm -hmm. Do you have uh, lots of cousins in your family? Yes, I have a, a lots lots of cousins. Uh, more more than uh, twenty. More than 20 cousins? Yes. <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay, it's a big family. <laughs> yes. Okay, cool. Um, my, my father was from... Hello, Vladimir. Oh, sorry, Olga. My father oh, was from big family. Ah, okay. So, mm -hmm. how many aunts and uncles do you have? A lot. Uh, and uncles, uh, I have uh, five aunts. Ankles and uh, four uh, out, uh, aunt. Oh, okay. Aunt. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Big family. Uh, okay, cool. And hi, Vladimir. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. How are you? I'm good, thanks. Um, could you tell us how many brothers and sisters do you have? Okay. I have no siblings, but I have uh, many nephews, I guess six, and uh, one niece, and uh, I have three cousins, mm -hmm. and uh, I have three aunts, mm -hmm. and two uncles. Oh, okay, wow, big family as well. <laughs> yes, but okay, they cool. are yeah. they are not my uh, close, <clears throat> not my close. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's not your house family. Yes, yes. You would say me. your immediate family. Okay, immediate family. That's your house family, like your brothers and sisters, your parents or your kids. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so that's your immediate family, and then everyone else is your extended family. Yes, they, they are. They are all my extended family, and in my family is just me and my mom. Ah, okay, okay, cool. And hello, Jose. Uh, sorry. Hello. Hi. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Um, where are you from? I'm from Spain. Spain, cool. And how many brothers and sisters do you have? I have two brothers and two sisters. Okay, you have a big family. <laughs> yes, five, five, six, five. Are you in the middle? Are you the oldest? No, I am the youngest. The youngest, okay, so you're the baby. Yes, yes. <laughs> Are you close with your brothers and sisters? 
uh, this my brother has to just more on this. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, I have two brothers. I'm in the middle. So I have an older brother and a younger brother and lots of cousins. <laughs> um, so today we're looking at prepositions of time. So I'm just going to share my screen so we can kind of go through them and then we'll do lots of exercises to practice. So maybe Olga, would you like to read about at for us? Sorry, I, I have no screens. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, yes. I can. Do you see um, the chat? Yes. Okay. I'll. Uh huh. There. Do you see it? Oh, maybe you're in the other chat. Let me see. Uh -huh. we ha I, I see. Yeah, okay. Yes. Uh, we, have, we have class at 2 o'clock and I, I have an appointment. I have an appointment with the doctor at 4 30. Mm -hmm. uh, we sleep uh, at night. Uh, my birthday is in July. Oh, I'll stop you there. So we'll look at oh, at first. Sorry. No, it's sorry. okay. Okay. So, good. So at, we use at with a specific time. Or you can say at night. Okay. So mm -hmm. a specific time like at 2 o'clock, at 4.30, or at night. And then the next one is in. Um, Vladimir, could you read about in for us? My birthday is in July. I was born in 1978. We have class in the morning. Jason has class in the afternoon. I study in the evening. Okay. So we use in for a specific month like July, a specific year, or for time phrases like in the morning, in the afternoon, in the evening. Okay? So at is for a specific time on the clock and in is for um, a certain time period, month, year. Okay? Um, and then we also use on. Um, Jose, can you read about on for us? Yes. yes. I have class on Monday. I was born on May 1st, uh, 1882. Good. So we can use on for a days of the week and for specific dates. So May 3rd, a specific date. And then we also use from and to to show a time period. So we have class from 3 o'clock to 4 o'clock. From a certain time to another time. You might say, I sleep every night from 11 to 7, or something like that. Okay. So we've got at, in, on, from, and to today. Do you guys have any questions about these prepositions? No? Okay. Let's try to fill in the blanks. This is the first one. We have class at, in, on, or from, into, 11 o'clock. Which one do you guys think? We'll start with um, Olga. Could you try number one for us? Olga? I don't know if you can so, see so, it. Sorry, teacher. Sorry. Okay. Uh, we, we have class in 11 o'clock. In 11 o'clock. Oh, I want to type. Uh, one second. I just have to. I'm just going to open this with preview so I can. There we go. Oh, it still won't let me read. Oh, well. Um, we have class in 11 o'clock. Do you guys agree? In 11 o'clock? 
Yes. I I think it's at. It's no. eleven. Sorry, yeah. eight, eleven. Yes. Good. One is at. We use at for a specific time, right? On the clock. Okay. What about number two, Vladimir? We have class from nine to eleven. Perfect. We have class from nine to eleven. Good. Um, Jose, try number three. Okay. Uh, Tom has class on the in the morning. Um, he works in the afternoon. In. Good. Good. In for both of them. Class in the morning. He works in the afternoon. Perfect. Um, Firkin, are you there? Yes, I am. Are you on your phone? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> um, can you see the screen? No. Can't no. Wait for me. <laughs> I sleep blank night. I sleep at night. Good. At night. Um, what about number six, Olga? Uh, Mary was uh, was born in October. Good. In October. And Vladimir? What about number seven? Me too. Um, oh, Vladimir. Mm, sorry. Okay. Mary was born in 1967. Good, 67. Good, born in 1967. And number eight, Jose? Mary was born uh, on October uh, 28. Good, perfect. Born on. Good. Um, Fergan? Mary was born blank October 28, 1967. Wow. Uh, on? Again? <laughs> on? On, yeah. Mary was born on October 28. Um, what about the next one, Olga? Number 10? Doug, the band isn't open on Sunday. Good, on Sunday. Sunday. Mm -hmm. And Vladimir, what about number 11? The bank is open from 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Monday through Saturday. Good. And last one, Jose. The bank closes at uh, 5 p.m. Closes at 5 o'clock. Now it says, now make your own prepositions using, or your own sentences using prepositions of time. It'll let me write. Start with Olga. Can you make a sentence using at? Mm, no. <laughs> what about a sentence using on? No. No? Okay. How about um, Vladimir? Yes. Can you with, make with on? Sure, on. Sure. Uh. Sorry, uh, I don't understand you. <laughs> it's okay. You just have to make a sentence using okay. one of the okay. prepositions. Yes. Uh, I uh, I uh, go to I go to bed at ten o'clock in the evening, and um, I go to work at seven in the morning. Perfect. Good. Ten in the evening, seven in the morning. Good. Perfect. Um, okay, Vladimir, your turn. I will go to the cinema on Monday. On Monday. Perfect. And Jose. Uh, yeah. What sentence is? Yep, using uh, from and to. Yes. yes. Oh, okay. Uh, I work from eight o'clock to three a, a p.m. Three o'clock p.m. Mm -hmm. Good. From eight to three. Perfect. Okay. Now.
use the information in the pictures to complete the sentences. Um, this might be kind of tough because the sentences are down here. So maybe we'll just come up with our answers for the sentences. <laughs> um, we have to make it a little bit bigger. OK. So we just have to fill in the blanks again. So number one, um, Olga, do you want to try? Mm -hmm. I was born in June 16. I was born in 1949. I am Doug 16. Mm -hmm. Good. I was born on uh, June 16. Uh, I'm a doctor. Okay. Yes. Uh, I go to work at uh, 5 a.m. Good. Where's this guy? Here he is. <laughs> the doctor. Okay. Uh, good. Number Mid two. Perfect. Yep. Uh, Me doctor too. <laughs> <laughs> You're a doctor? Yes. <laughs> oh, very cool. What kind of doctor are you? Ultrasound diagnostic. Oh, I see. I'm definitely not a doctor. <laughs> that takes lots, lots of school to be a doctor, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. And do you wake up at 5 a.m.? No, no, yeah. I go to at um, 7 a.m. Okay, cool. Um, all right. Vladimir, why don't you try number two for us? I go to work in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. I go to work at 12 p.m. I am a accountant. I was born in March. Good. So he goes to work at noon, was born in March. Who is it? Princess. Yes, or maybe I don't know if it's a princess or a queen, something like yeah. that. <laughs> okay. Okay, good. Okay. Um, what about number three, Jose? Okay. Hi. I am. I am. Well, we don't know yet. Let's answer this part first, and then we'll find out who it is. <laughs> Hi, I am... Uh, um, I don't know. Okay. Let's start with, I go to work. I go, I go to work in the morning. Mm -hmm. I start work from 11 o'clock a.m. Mm -hmm. I was born on April 10. Okay, good. There's I start work at 11 a.m. Yes, perfect. It's at, right? Good. So I start work at 11. I was born on April 10th. Who am I? Uh, <laughs> Peter. Yeah, this guy. A painter. A painter. Okay, cool. Okay. Okay, and number four, we've got some new friends. Oleg? Is that how I say it? Oleg? Can you hear me? Hmm, I can't hear you. I think you're typing. You've got your camera. Oleg, can you hear me? I can't hear you. Do you have a microphone? Maybe muted. Click on your microphone up here. Ah, there you go. Maybe. Can you hear me? Hello? Okay, I'll type. He's typing. Um, hi, Yuki. Hi. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you too. How are you doing? 
Uh, fine. Thank you. Cool. Haven't seen you in a few days. <laughs> um, <laughs> Yuki, do you want to try number four? Uh, can you paste the link of the page? Sure. I... Oh, yeah, sure. It's in, uh, um, let me just find the link. Right. I can't see here. the screen. Okay. You are. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And we're on number. Just a minute. Number four, once you get uh, there. Okay. Number four? Number four? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, yes, number four. I study, yes? Oh, um, on the next page, page next two. Page. Ah, ah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I got it. Okay. Howdy. I was born, I was, I was, I was born in July, July 2nd, 1978. I am a, July, July. I am a cowboy. Yeah. Uh, I I milk I milk the cow cows in the morning. I I milk the cows at at six a.m. six o'clock a.m. Good, perfect. A well, just this one. I was born blank July second, nineteen seventy eight. Which preposition goes here? On July. Mm hmm. On July second, nineteen seventy-eight. Good. Yep. Yeah. So we use on for a specific date. Good. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. And Olga, do you want to try number five? Yes. Um. Hey, I am a footballer. Yeah, footballer. Yeah, a football player. Football, football player. Mm -hmm. uh, I was born on August 1st. I was born in 1999. Uh, uh, I go to uh, practice uh, from 7 a.m. Good. So I was born on in. I was born in 1999. In, in yes. In. And which preposition do we need here? Uh, I go oh. to practice from 7 a.m. Right, so if we're using from, we also from. have to use to. Uh, like to. From mm -hmm. 7 to 3, or from 8 to 9. But since there's no to, and it's just a specific time, we use at. Like uh, it, it. Uh -huh. I go to practice at 7 a.m. Mm -hmm. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, okay. Uh, Jose. Mm, yes. You want to try number six? Okay. I was born in 1992. Mm -hmm. I go to work at night. Mm -hmm. I go to work at 10 p.m. Mm -hmm. I work at 9 because I like to take pictures of the stairs. Mm -hmm. I am a photographer. Good. Photographer. 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 Good. Okay. And last one, number 7. Vladimir? Good day, citizen. I'm a policeman. I was born in May. I was born in 1980. I go to work at 6 a.m. Move along, citizen. <laughs> <laughs> Move along, citizen. <laughs> the police officer. Good. Okay. All right. Let's try something else. Have a game. My sentence monkey. Prepositions of time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, here we go. We'll do it all together. So, what do you often do on, to, since, in, at the weekend? 
in in the weekend what do you do often do in the weekend mm -hmm. <coughs> nope mm. <laughs> it's actually in british it, english, it, it, in it. Bri yeah in british english it's at the weekend at in mm. american english it's on the weekend so uh, on the british thing <laughs> At the weekend. Okay, let's try the next one. My father often works late. Yeah, in, in night. In night. In night? At night. Yeah, at night. At, at night. At, at night. night. <laughs> okay. I first visited Beijing in in 1996. Okay. Mm -hmm. Next one. Um, everyone, if you know the answer, you can just say it. It's for everybody, okay? My dad will be away Four. 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 Good. Four. Mm -hmm. I have been a teacher since mm. since 1988. <laughs> I got to school blank nine o'clock this morning. It. Mm hmm. I often go home at seven o'clock blank the in, in. Good. <laughs> I haven't seen Jerry since. since since last May. The hungry British monkey. There's a party blank my house on Friday. Four. Yeah. In my house. Oh. In my house. Mm -hmm. at, at my house. At, yeah, at my house. At yeah. my house. Mm -hmm. It's much at my house. This one is a preposition of place, actually. Place. Yeah. It looks uh -huh. like it, it's in the wrong spot, <laughs> but that's okay. Uh -huh. Preposition of place. At my house. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. um, we drank a lot. Blank Christmas Eve. The specific day. On. Oh. On. Oh. Good. Mm -hmm. So on for holidays and other specific days. Ooh, the end. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't make it any bigger. Can you can you guys see it? Yes, I can see. Okay, so let's figure out where our different words go. We have Christmas Day. Should it be on? On. 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 Okay. January. In. 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 My childhood. In. In. Okay. My birthday. On. 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 Christmas. On. On. No. On. In. Uh, on. Uh, specific. In. In. <laughs> in. Yeah, on. At. O on. On. At. At. Uh, why, why it? Uh. On Christmas Day. So uh. when you're speaking generally about a holiday time, you use at. When you're speaking about the specific day, you use on. Oh. Mm. On Christmas Day, on Easter morning, at Easter. On oh, New Year's Eve, at. Mm, it should say New, New Year's, Year's, but New, New Year's. Year. Eat it at. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So on is for specific holiday, and at is for. 
general time of the holiday. General okay. time. What about um, Tuesday? On. 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 Specific day. Mm -hmm. What about 1999? In. 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 Mm -hmm. November? In. 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 Oh, oh. In. in, same as the other in. month, January, right? In January, in November. What about April on. 15th? On. Good. And at? The moment. At the moment. Wow! <laughs> Perfect. Okay. And then we have one more. It's my birthday. On. On, on. on Monday. Mm -hmm. I was born mm. in 2002. I've got maths. Uh, mm -hmm. Christmas Day is on. on. Mm -hmm. I'm practicing my English. At. At. I go to bed. At. At. Mm -hmm. I love going to the beach. In. Mm -hmm. I love opening my presents. On. 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 I'm going to be a teacher. In. 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 In the last one, I usually wake up. At. It. At. Okay, you guys have nailed these time prepositions, I think. So, <laughs> time to test your skills. I'm going to um, just open a document. One second here. If I can get to work. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. Yes. Okay. Here's the document. There's the link. And basically, what I want you to do, I want to see that you guys are able to produce these without being prompted with the blanks. So I want you to write daily, oops, daily routine. So you can just Choose, write your name, so right. So I want you to try to write a paragraph telling us about what you usually do and try to use each of the prepositions at least twice. I can't open this document. I, 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 yes, I, I, I can't either. Okay. Uh, they ask the, they, they ask permission. Okay. Try it, try it now, try it again. Okay. It should work now. Yes. Yes? Okay. Yes. Good. So, please use, uh, Okay, mm -hmm. your answer. Mm -hmm. And then I'll go through and I'll check and see how you've done and um, if you've used them all correctly, okay? So you can just write your names you know, and um, write your paragraph underneath. Okay, does everyone understand? If you're watching outside, you can participate, okay? <laughs> I gave you the link in the chat. So if you're watching, you can also participate, okay, in the writing part. So go ahead. Yuki's here. Let's get a spot for Jose and Oleg and Olga, Vladimir. And Yuki's already up there, right? Good. 
Okay. What, what had I missed? What is this? Like, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, so. my, my browser was freezing. It's, it's my okay. So you're going to please write about your daily routine. What do you usually do? At what time? What sort of hobbies do you have? And I want you to use at, in, on, and from, slash, to, at least two times in your answer. Okay. Okay. And if you're outside, you can write down here. Okay, Yuki's good. Oleg has started. Vladimir. Jose, is this you, Anonymous Mink? <laughs> it's probably you. Okay. And you can just tell me when you're finished your paragraph, okay? Oh, we lost our leg. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. 
Jose is writing. Okay, I'm gonna copy and paste Jose's <laughs> into a document. Okay, Olga still writing. You guys are doing awesome. Remember, tell me if you're finished, and then I can take a look for you. I think Jose might be finished. Um, Jose, are you finished? I finished. Um, I put it on, into the document here. So if you look at my screen, you can see I'll be editing it there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ready? <laughs> okay, I usually, usually, okay, so I usually wake up at perfect clock, period. I get up at, good, 7.15, I usually, with two L's, have breakfast in, good, perfect, with a capital, then... I go to work. Ah, oh, good use of your semicolon. That's perfect. I work from from eight to two. Awesome. Um. Oh, okay. I work from eight to two. From eight to from. Remember to use capital letters for your days of the week. Okay. Monday to Friday. Then I have to go mm, go at my house. It's actually go to my house. You go to your house. Okay? To have... Can, can we say go home? Yeah, you could say go to my house or... Go home. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Come home. Come home, come home. or go home. 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 Yeah, if you say come home, to, um, to come home means... You would say this when you're at home. You'd say, oh, I came home an hour ago. Now I'm home. Uh -huh, right? uh -huh, uh -huh. So once you're here, you've come home. Um, otherwise, you're going home. Okay? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Um, to go home. To have um, lunch. If, if we write uh, in, in, uh, in my, uh, my daily book, uh, mm -hmm. usually we use to uh, uh, go home. Mm hmm Yeah. If we you're write, sorry, if can you write, if we I write to in my diary. Right, you would say I went I, home. I would say went home. I uh -huh. went, home went home at noon. Or if you're not writing to, not, if not you're writing from not home. Not came home. Not came home. Not came home. But went home. Yeah? Right. So it depends. So if you're sitting at home while you're writing, mm -hmm. you would write, I came ah. home at noon. You see? I'm still mm -hmm. home. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, but mm -hmm. if you're talking, you're maybe you're in your office. You're telling mm -hmm. us I went home at noon. So you mm -hmm. use came when you're still at home. Ah. Okay. Makes sense. But but uh, but but uh, you, usually we 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 write a uh, uh, day um, uh, diary in 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 form, yeah. Um, so, if you're so, mm -hmm. so usually we write uh, we came home, yeah. In the day, in the mm -hmm. diary. So in your diary, you could really choose either one. It uh -huh. doesn't really matter. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Thank you. John can join this class if he wants. <laughs> um, and Jose, okay, to have lunch. I have a nap for, okay, I, I take a nap. I take a nap for 30 minutes, good. And after, I return home, oh, I return to work for two hours, good. Oops, oh dear. I finish, I finish at work and I go to the park with my son at 7 o'clock. Oh, good. If you want to write o'clock, it's like this, apostrophe, o'clock, 7 o'clock. Can, can, we, can we say just, can, can we say only I, I finish work, I, fi I finish my work? Yep, you could just say I finish work. I finish work, it's okay. It's also yeah. okay. yeah, that's uh -huh. fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or or work. at work, my work. Yep. At work is okay. At work? Is, yep, is that's fine too. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Vladimir. <laughs> at night, we regret at home. Mm. Hmm. I'm not sure what you're trying to say with regret. You might say <laughs> we, we go, you know, something like that. But at night is perfect. Mm -hmm. At night. Mm -hmm. At night. Mm -hmm. Very good. Lots of ats in, from, to, perfect. Good job. Um, is anyone else finished? I finished. Yes. Who? Yuki? Yes. And me. And, and, me too. Every, and everyone. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yuki, I usually wake up at perfect 6 a.m. and study in, oh, in the my. In my. Ah, uh, okay. Without in my the, private room mm -hmm. until after I eat breakfast in the kitchen. Good. Take a nap on the sofa at the guest mm -hmm. room. Oh, so very close. But when when you're talking about so a room, you use in. In. In the guest room. Okay. Uh -huh. In my bedroom. In the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm for an hour because um, uh, H is silent in hour. Uh -huh. So because it's an H, use an, an hour. Okay. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I go out for the work. At work. Uh, yeah, or just work. I go to work. I go to work. Yeah, at 10. I come to our office at... Let's say you, you get to the office uh -huh. mm -hmm. and work there until 5 p.m. I come home at 6. I have supper at 7 in the this, comma, good. Uh -huh. um, when you have a phrase like after, after that, after this, you need a comma. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. After this, I take a shower in the word. In the bathroom. Uh, uh, sorry, after this, after that, uh, both is available. Right. After, so yes. After that. There, there are no difference uh, between not, after this, after that. After this, after that. Mm, not really. Yeah. When you're telling really. a story, you can you can use both of them pretty much. I would use uh -huh. after that. I think it sounds a little bit better after that. Um, but it doesn't really matter. There is, it, when you're it, telling it, a story, yeah. there there is no no difference in nuance, mm -mm. In nuance, yeah. No, not not really. And with the phrase, it's fine either way, Yuki. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
I take a shower in the bathroom. Ooh, our bathroom is red now. And I go to sleep in. Very, very good. Really good. Thank you. Yeah, your prepositions are perfect, actually. I go at the only one that you missed was only this in one the, in room. The, at the, at the room. <laughs> yeah, good. I good job. I Yep. Okay, um, who's next? My next victim. <laughs> ah, sorry, like, in, the, in the guest room, uh, the, is, the is needed. The. In the, yeah, in the guest room, in the kitchen, in the, in the bathroom, kitchen. the living room. Not yeah. in guest room, in the guest room, yeah? Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that? Uh -huh. yeah okay. exactly. Um, okay, a leg, anonymous duck. <laughs> Usually get up at good six a.m. I do my morning exercises and take a shower. Oh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. oh is this this is Olga's right? Yeah. Yes. Take, take a shower. Good. Yes. At six thirty. Okay. I go walk with my dog. Ah, okay. I, we actually I, have a way to say this. I walk. Take I my take. dog for a walk. Or uh -huh. walk my. Okay. Okay. You can choose. Uh -huh. um, uh -huh. And I walk to 7 a.m. Ah, it's a different one here. It starts with a U. Does anyone know? Un. Until. Yeah. Until. Uh, until. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Until. Until. Until that's when you stop. So we use until uh -huh. to show that our time has stopped at a certain moment. Okay. I have breakfast at 7.15. Good. At, I go to work at 7. Good. Like this for your times. At 7.30. My working day is from to perfect. Mm, okay, so in European time and in, we call it army time, you use 15, like you use the 24-hour clock. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. If you're using, yeah, okay. if you're using a.m., p.m., it should be yes. 3. 3, okay. Mm -hmm. You can use 15, but then it should say... Yes, I see. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I work 6... Ah, days. Days, days. Okay. Perfect. Very good. Good, good. Okay. Mm. Oh, they want a space here. That's why. I don't know. Okay. Vladimir, are you ready? I'm done. <laughs> okay. Up at 10... Oh, sorry, 10 a.m. I eat breakfast in front of the... <laughs> okay. In the afternoon, I go to the sea... I have lunch from 30 p.m. Also, when it's both in p.m., you only have to put the second one. Okay. Yes, yeah, so you can say from 9 to 9.30 p.m. I was born on, good. I will have, I will have work on. Yes. Yeah. Good. I'll work. I'll work on Saturday and Sunday. Okay. Do you work every Saturday and Sunday? No, it's just oh, this week. It's this weekend. Okay. I don't sleep at night <laughs> because <laughs> I have glasses on verbally. <laughs> I also study in the evening. You don't sleep. <laughs> yes. Oh no. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Perfect. Very good. Very good. Um, okay. Uh, no one from outside joined us today, but that's all right. Did I did I look at everyone's? Let's see. Olga, Jose, Yuki. Yes. Okay. Perfect. So, when is the next class? In five minutes. Five what? minutes. But the next one is um, intermediate, advanced. The next one. You guys can still join, of course. Um, but for John, so the, John who is watching, the next class is a bit harder. <laughs> um, cool. Do you guys have any questions about time prepositions?
I feel like you've like nailed them. <laughs> I think you're good. What do you think? Thank you. You're welcome. Any questions for me about anything else? I heard the question, but I forgot. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> it's probably because what? you haven't slept. <laughs> <laughs> yes, maybe. Okay, cool. Um, okay, well, then. It is, it is, still, still, it is still, still difficult to, to me to use, uh, use in, art, in and out correctly. Mm hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. And what uh, will we do in next lesson? In the next lesson, we are reading a play, and I'm helping you with your pronunciation. Okay, I'm gonna miss it because I will take a shower and have and a, a nap. <laughs> and yeah, and a late uh, lunch. Oh no, a late dinner. It's midnight. Oh. No problem. But, do you now? Do you now in Moscow? Or? No, I'm I'm in Sochi. So uh, Sochi, I, I, I had it. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's night time in Russia now. Midnight, midnight, midnight in so, Moscow. Yes. It's um it's 4 p.m. in Toronto. <laughs> ah, 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Ah, <laughs> daytime, yeah. So it's bedtime in Europe, but it's afternoon over here. <laughs> Um, Yuki, I, I gave you a link with um, some more information about your time prepositions. Uh -huh. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. um, maybe that will be helpful. And then if you click next at the bottom, there's uh -huh. um, prepositions yes, uh, placed yes, too. I see now. Yes. Mm -hmm. oh. mm. Here's prepositions of place. Cool. Mm -hmm. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Hopefully Thank you very much. If I Thank don't you very much. You in a minute, yes, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? Yes. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Bye. I see go to night. sleep it. Okay. Bedtime. <laughs> 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 okay. Midnight. Good, good, good night, night everyone. <laughs>